Hey guys, it's Erica. We're gonna be checking out Limelight's Mew 2020. So I know they're having to come back, but are they? We are we getting little like solo songs from the three girlies? Um, because I also believe it's their. Is this right? Is this for Limelight their last comeback as three? Because they're gonna be adding more members um for future stuff. So that's exciting. That's interesting. We haven't really seen that in K-pop in a minute of adding members. Normally it's like somebody leaves and then they add somebody or add three people or it get. Let's not talk about the history of K-pop, okay? We're, that is not what this video is for. This video is for uh, me. I'm excited to be checking this out. Excited for Limelight's comeback. I enjoy their stuff, and especially if we're getting little solo moments, which kind of makes sense for me, because with, like, Icon and stuff, I mean, Icon's a little different, you know, pre-established group, big fan base, you know what I mean? But they really have allowed um, the Icon members to really uh, pursue stuff, like, solo-wise, whether it's all, like, the Icon album, or like did one solo or like Bobby solo, uh, which Bobby was already like established solo. It's like pre it's a little complicated, you know. I feel like Icon's a little different, but kind of seeing the freedom that I the Icon members have had to do um, solo stuff, it's kind of making sense. The math is math for me that Limelight would also get some little solo moments. So that's all I'm trying to say. Anyways, you know what it let go. Okay. Oh, do you see the little green hair light? I saw it. I peeped it. The sparkly boots? Oh, hello. Okay. Shopping, yes, ma'am. that they're going to is really great. Also, love the pants. The different looks are like everything. I'm living. Oh, fun. As somebody who has a different setting every single day. <laughs> Stay in the youth, girl. Same. Look at my bedroom. This does not look like the bedroom of a 25 year old. <laughs> Almost 26. <laughs> I'm not over the fits, girl. I like the drop though. I meant to mention that the drop is really, really cool. It's a very kind of like you would hear more stuff like drops like that in like third generation noise music era. Um, but like, like girl groups that have come from smaller companies have kind of had that sound a little bit but i really liked what they did here with it um yeah not over the fits i think because like oh because i mean obviously costuming is important um and outfits are like always important for like a comeback and a look and i feel like it's just a way to like express yourself in a song like this that's like you make me feel like i'm 20 i'm in my youth the music video is kind of like her in these different looks expressing different sides of her you know what i mean so i feel like that fits are very very important and they were like so cute living for everything especially because of me again i have a different aesthetic every day who are you getting today you'll never know i don't even know girl because sometimes i'm like it, it gets, it's been bad recently to where i'm like i do my makeup one way and then i want to like say i'll do like green eyeshadow and then i'm like 
let me wear a red shirt and I'm like what am I doing oh my god um but <laughs> yeah but I really liked it I think the song is really great I feel like yeah I feel I don't know whenever we get like a little solo stuff I'm like I get to know the members more you know so that's what I feel here um I think the song was really great it showed off her like vocals really really well and I feel like the video was a great showcase of it too I think it was really nice kind of more like location based her in different outfits kind of showing off her different charms you know what I mean um that was a really good concept for the video um if we get ones from the other members which I hope we do um hope it'll kind of be you know something similar well like not like carbon copy but you know like if this is just the concept for this one it definitely makes sense but like it'll be interesting to see what we get out of them if it's kind of a similar concept I'm Gucci gang with it um but I think the song was really great it was cool the drop was dope I feel like I haven't heard a drop like that in a minute so it feels very very nice and fresh and sometimes you know I'm st we're stuck in our youthful days because again I'm almost 26. Look, does this bedroom look like a 26 year old's bedroom is supposed to be? I'm kind of well also my Christmas presents that my mom gave me this year I was like are you trying to make me be an adult? Because like, she got me like a cute little lounge set and I'm just like, I just, I just wear like, like literally you wanna, sorry to ruin the illusion, but literally I have baby Yoda pajamas on. Um, normally this is just like presentable and cute. Whatever is below is something crazy like these baby Yoda pajamas and fuzzy socks, okay? And I'm like, this is what I wear, this is what, like, this is what I'm comfortable in. Why are you getting a monochromatic, um, <laughs> lounge set that I'm like, it's cute, don't get me wrong, but I'm like, is it me? And it's really cute though. Um, and then she also got me like a cardigan, but like, it's, it's not my style. If you can, if you, I mean, you watch me, right? So you know that it leans alt sometimes, most of the time, I could argue, and with like black, I don't wear a lot of t-shirts or whatever, but, um, that's where I would, I would kind of say it's, it leans to, um, and it's, it looks, it's, the, what I describe it as is a cardigan that looks like it's for a kindergarten teacher. Um, and it says like sport on it and there's like colors and there's patches and I'm like, oh, this is not me. <laughs> this is not me. She's like, it can look so cute with your skirt. And I'm just like, the skirt that I have cardigans that I already wear with it. Like I do, and she's like, she's like, you're so ungrateful. And I'm like, <laughs> mom, you literally see how I dress and I do my makeup every day. Give card next time, mom. Give card next time. Okay, you can't fail. Um, but then she did hit with the Batman Crocs that she got me, so that's... Yeah, I relate to the song is all I'm trying to say. That was the point of that part of the video, but I think the visuals were great. The outfits were killer throughout. Um, and yeah, I mean, I really like the embrace of kind of just like, you know, the different looks of the different aesthetics because can relate um, clearly too well. Um, but yeah, but the video was fun. It was really cute. I think it was nicely edited. Nothing too complex or complicated. The most complex thing would be like the rotating kind of camera shot that they did. Um, but other than that, everything was like beautiful and stunning and she looked gorgeous in every scene and the song was really great. So I loved it. Go to your thoughts and comments down below to chat about um, me, you, for Limelight's 2020. If you like this video, give this video a thumbs up. If you liked me and you want to see more of my videos, go and hit that subscribe button. If you want to see my videos the second they come out, hit that notification button. If you want to follow me on social media, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, threads, or description down below, or at the end screen. If you like gaming content, I have a gaming channel. It's called Erica Just Games. Link to the description down below. Currently playing GTA 5, so if you can join me over there for that. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Love you, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.